Monique Olivier, now 75, and in court to be judged for her role in horrific, brutal crimes, for helping her husband to kill and kill again. Today she spoke only to ask for forgiveness from the families of her victims. Olivier lured in girls and young women for her husband, Michel Fourneret, to rape, beat and murder. She even used their baby child as a lure. Fourneret died two years ago, before this trial could begin, so it's just his wife here, found guilty of complicity in three further murders. Among them, Joanna Parrish, a 20-year-old student from Gloucestershire who was working in France as part of her university course, raped, killed and her body then dumped in the River Yon. Joanna's parents were in court to see Olivier sentenced to another life term. She will never leave prison. From the very first moment that a victim was identified, she knew exactly, exactly what would happen to them. After this last obstacle in our struggle to gain an element of justice for Joanna has been overcome, we can remember our daughter and sister with a smile on our faces, which is how, of course, all her many friends remember her. Thank you very much. As well as Joanna, Olivier was also convicted of complicity in the murder of Marie-Angèle Domès, who was 18, and nine-year-old Estelle Musin. Monique Olivier said she regretted what she'd done and described these murders as monstrous. She claimed to have been intimidated and bullied by her husband, but this court heard that in reality, she had done nothing to stop him killing. Olivier's lawyer, adamant that her sense of shame reflects well on her. What's important is that she isn't claiming responsibility for the crimes that were committed by Michel Fourneret. In my opinion, he wouldn't have expressed any regrets. But the lawyer who represented the families believes there are more victims. There is some case in French about Fourniret and Monique Olivier, which are not judged, so the fight will go on for other family. It is more than 33 years since Roger and Pauline's daughter was murdered. Joanna, the victim of a serial killer and his colluding wife. Now, finally, justice has been delivered. Adam Parsons, Sky News, Nanterre.